What is up everybody on YouTube? This is your boy Derek Vincent back with another video. In today's video, we're gonna do like a vlog. I kind of wanna buy like some updated clothes. I don't have much like t-shirts and stuff like that. We still have like two more months of summer of hot weather and I wanna get right. So I'm gonna be going around looking for some nice clothes before I go out um, to any more functions for the summer, you feel me? Um, so yeah, guys, this first place we're gonna go to right in town is called Flight Vintage. So I'm gonna go check them out and we'll see where else we go today. All right, first place we're at. First place we're at is this family sto dollar store or thrift store rather, and Salvation Army. And you know, I, I had to put out the Salehi Benberry Crocs. So we're gonna check this place out. I haven't been here in a minute, so quick day, thrift day. All right, the first thing is first. You know, we're in the men's section. A lot of t-shirts. I picked up this tee so far, and then another, you know, tea that I might put down but I do like this you know pale green look so there's a whole lot more stuff that I want to look at so they were all right came out of there with two things a t-shirt and a nice pullover for the fall and I, I'm actually really excited I, like I actually generally like it ten dollars for two things so basically one the the pullover was the pullover was seven dollars and nine nine cents, so eight dollars, and then the tea was two dollars, so ten bucks. About it. All right, the next place is Flight Vintage. This is right here. This is I try to come here. This is my third time trying to come here now and shop. And if it's closed, then I'm just not gonna be a customer anymore. I'm trying, bro, but every time I come here, it's always closed. So let's really try. I see clothes outside though, so it must be open. So I'm let's go in. All right, so I'm at Flight Vintage right now. They have a sale going on where everything outside is $10. Definitely, definitely seeing some nice stuff. So I'm definitely gonna be walking out of here with some with some fire. So this is the same, um, you know, little thrift spot that came to URI one day, and I bought some a whole bunch of stuff. So yeah, look at this, guys. Like, all right. So yeah, guys, flight vintage. Definitely got some ballad stuff. Definitely got some ballad stuff. Very, very um pleased. And I'm, I'll show you guys everything I got in like an hour. All right, next place we're going to is The Gap. And The Gap is, you know, it's Kanye's spot. So I gotta support Kanye. So I'm doing, I'm here right now and let's see what we got. <laughs> not really my style, but I do like, not my, not what I'm looking for. I would wear this, but it's not what I'm, I'm looking for right now. But I do like it though. These two button ups or button downs, 60 bucks, bro. $50, $60 for these shirts where, you know, I can get them from, from Marshall's for $15. So it might be slow for, for today at the Gap. So I might ask for a job though. <laughs> All right, so we just left Gap. Gap wasn't bad. Wasn't really stuff I was looking for though. So, you know, I ended up leaving, got some quick little footage. However, I asked for a side job, a part-time job, and the manager of the store was actually a girl I went to college with. And uh, we connected a little bit and she's actually the manager for the, the store. So um, she said, I know you when you apply in September, cause that's when we will be applying and then we'll be hiring and you know i i know you so and i was like say less say less so always good to have connects and that's a month away so a good little part-time job at a store like that then i'll get the stuff that they sell i'll get the the expensive polos and and button downs because it's not bad it's just it wasn't what i was looking for but if i'm working there it's whatever. all right everyone dick sporting goods 
we're just trying to see if we got we can get some swords and maybe some boxing and stuff with stuff for for my new sport so for boxing so we'll see immediately i have this amazing brown book bag that i actually might have to get for traveling um this is just fire and then they just have a large selection of sweatpants different colors the hoodies are right over here a whole lot of stuff like i'm about to all right so off rip i might have to pick up these orange shorts for the gym but look at these nike these updated nike techs like oh my god like jesus nike tech always valid i have these colors so i'm not gonna buy these but there's so much stuff and the crazy thing about having connects what I just say about connects, my boy, my neighbor literally works here. I didn't even know. And he just seen me. He was like, bro, text me whenever and I'll get you right. That's all life is about connection, man. So fire and still looking like Today was a valid day. I got some shorts, got some shirts, spent $80 on myself. Well worth it. I'm worth 80 bucks. Felt good. Got some job interviews lined up. Got some job opportunities in the way. I'm currently in Chick-fil-A to get me a milkshake and on this hot day, it's like 85 plus today. So that's me. Say hi to the vlog if you want to. Hi. <laughs> but just got me a milkshake. So yeah, it was a valid day and I'll show you guys everything I got when I get home. What is up everybody on YouTube? This is Derek. So I'm back home from thrifting all day. I was out for like two and a half hours and I picked up a good amount of stuff. And I just want to show you guys in real time. So we went to like four different stores. We went to Salvation Army. We went to Flight Vintage. We went to Dick's, we went to Gap. And then we went to Dick's Sporting Goods. And then we got things from three out of the four places. So I just wanted to show you so what I got from Dick's, I just grabbed, you know, a pair of orange shorts. Um, I have so many of these shorts that I just felt like I should, I don't have orange. So I was like, let me just get the orange ones, you know, complete this set. I don't have yellow or I don't have um, a light baby blue. So those are the next in the list or like a dark green. So I got these shorts today. Not bad. $35 from Dick's. I now do have a connect there though. My Literally my neighbor that I grew up with he's like yo like like i work here so whenever you want to shop here um just text me whatever you want and i'll buy it and then just them on me whatever with his discount so like i'm saving money forever now as long as he works there so the first thing was from dicks not bad so next we are going to show you guys the stuff i got from the um salvation army so i picked up this pullover it was eight dollars and it's a baseball Nike Eastern Connecticut tee. And I just thought it was different. And it has the number 51 on the back. Um, it's not like, I'm not repping Eastern. I'm not, it's just, it's just nice, honestly. And um, when the time comes to wear this, I definitely will be wearing this. It's too hot to wear this now, of course, but I do like it. So again, quick little, little pullover, eight bucks, cannot go wrong. Next, we have another thing from the Salvation Army. This nice little olive polo, like literally a polo shirt. And I got this for two bucks. So can't go wrong with this. Um, olive color. It has the nice little polo so uh, symbol in it. So not bad. Two dollars from the Salvation Army. Cannot go wrong. Now this is from Flight Vintage. This place is came to URI uh, back in like, I want to say March. Um, and they had a lot of stuff that I bought. I bought like four or five things from them that day and it was like a like a, a big bin for like five dollars everything in it for five dollars so i had they had a sale today everything outside for 10 bucks so this was one thing outside a firestone tee 10 bucks red can't go wrong i don't have a lot of red t-shirts so i figure i get this just to start you know diversifying my my t-shirts you know what i mean i have shoes that have red in them but i don't have anything to wear with it so First thing I had to get, Firestone tea, 10 bucks. And then next, another thing that was a steal, in my opinion, for $10 outside, and arguably my favorite thing I bought, is this Nike shirt. So it's not like a t-shirt, it is not, and it's, it's heavy like a pullover, 
and it has this like really uh, thick material, but it's obviously a t-shirt. So it's, and it has the Nike, it has the gray uh, shoulder pads, whatever. And it's nice, $10. Couldn't believe I found this out there. Um, very still, very much a still, and I'm definitely gonna be wearing this. Um, you know, I can wear this year round. It's heavy enough for the fall. It's heavy enough for the winter when you're inside, not outside, but when you're inside and it's a little chilly inside, you can put this on. And it's still a t-shirt, so a short sleeve. So I can wear this in the spring and I can wear this in the summer if I choose to. So it's a very versatile shirt and um, I, I really like this. So I'm glad I found this for $10, can't go wrong. And the most expensive thing I got today, um, oh, actually this is the second thing. This was 30, the shorts were 35. So second most expensive thing today, but a very nice shirt is this Top Gun shirt. So I haven't seen any of the movies. I'm not like a like a fanboying over it. However, when I saw this shirt in the store, I saw Wingman on the back and I was like, okay, like that's fire. Like I like that. So I got this shirt and cannot go wrong. So that's everything I got today uh hope you guys enjoyed the vlog hope you guys um leave a like subscribe to the channel more videos on the way thank you for your patience and let's keep grinding have a good rest of